Ya coa, ya coa. guys welcome to the new vlog welcome welcome today is a saturday today is a saturday it's a beautiful we have a beautiful weather in Cape Town today i love a cozy rainy day so i'm pretty much not i'm not gonna do anything today plus i don't have nails whatsoever right now so I was hoping to go get these removed, like I just wanted to soak them off, give my nails a week, and then go do another set. Because I don't know what's going on, I don't know why my nails are not lasting. But anyway, happy Saturday, today is a Saturday. It is very gloomy, very cold in Cape Town today. In fact, I'm about to take my heater out. My heater was put away. So, I mean, I had put it away when I was moving. It's in that office, in that wardrobe. So I'm going to take it out now. I'm hoping that I still have some gas. I think I still have some gas. I remember that heater being so heavy. So I'm going to take it out now. Um, so I woke up today. It's actually... What's the time? It's half past three. What? Where did the time go? It's half past three. So, yeah. So, I woke up this morning and I finished editing tomorrow's vlog and we are done. <laughs> we are done with the vlog. I just need to export it and upload it. Um, yeah. So, I woke up, I edited and then I got up, I think around two tidied up the house and then took a shower that's pretty much it did my skincare routine wore some clean pajamas because we are not going anywhere today we're not going anywhere well as if <laughs> as if i have somewhere to go but yeah we're not going anywhere today um i just want to chill watch netflix enjoy this weather indoors and that's pretty much all we're doing today so yeah we don't have plans for the day so now i just want to make myself breakfast first i want to take that heater out switch it on because we are banda and then i'm gonna take some blanking to the couch <coughs> oh one thing about me here sana even if it's cold i'll open the windows because 
we need some oxygen <laughs> so we need we need some fresh air in the house so um, yeah so let me make myself breaky let me put on the heater make myself breaky and then I'm gonna watch a little housewife of Kaleha and just chill so welcome to a chilled vloggy vlog yeah I hope you enjoy I hope you if you haven't subscribed already please do subscribe and if you are new in this channel we have good times over here so welcome and I hope you subscribe <laughs> anyway let me go make breakfast and then watch Real Housewives of GQ yes I'm going to make breakfast at 20 to 4 because one thing about me and breakfast one thing about me and breakfast, Sana, we go together. Whenever you're down, out in the cold, faithless and dark, your story's untold. Come take my hand and walk there with me. to act tough today is a Sunday it's a Sunday and it's just after five seven minutes past five and I have been a bum the whole day but you know what those days are sometimes necessary so yeah I woke up I, I pretty much stayed in bed I think up until 11 or 12 and then took a shower, changed location, came to the couch and I've been watching Netflix. I've been watching The Diplomat. It's currently number one on Netflix, 10 out of 10. I binge watched it. I finished it. So now I don't have anything to watch. I'm watching Oh How to Get Rich, um, also on Netflix. However, comma. Guys, I don't deserve my friends. I do not deserve my friends at all. Usiba just dropped off its seven colors for your girl. She just dropped off seven colors for your girl. And I'm so happy because I didn't do my weekly groceries. So I wanted to cook. So I don't have veggies. I wanted to cook. I was going to go to... Okay, I tried to order stuff off Woolies app and they said they'll only deliver tomorrow i was like okay let me go to the shops and sana your girl said i mean usiba said she's outside um and they came to drop off some food for your girl so i am so happy let me show you i haven't even unpacked it Ooh, let me show you guys she, I thought she was just gonna drop off some chicken. Um, Mama K came with Inyam, so she had said she's gonna bring some for me. Asana, it looks like this is an entire seven colors. This is beetroot, and it 
looks like beetroot and um, potato salad, some beans, and this is the main chick. This is the main chick. Oh, it was an omelette. And what is this? Some some bag. Oh, hey, boy, guys. Do I even deserve this girl? Let me push her up. This is my Sunday course. Thank you so much, my friend. Thank you, Siba girl. I look a little bit disheveled because Sana, I'm trying I'm trying to like multitask Yo, I'm not even wearing earrings or nothing but anyway hey guys hey guys how y'all doing <laughs> hey guys today's a Monday um Today's a Monday and I'm working from home. It is a half past one, so I quickly stepped out because I had a delivery at my old place. I have a delivery from Amazon, something I've been waiting for. I'm excited. Okay, it's not that big of a deal. I'll show you guys. Um yeah, and then I I'm waiting for the guy to while well, the guy is gonna come drop the stuff at two at my old place so I came a little bit earlier this side because I want to quickly go to Cielo um, we only have two Cielos in Cape Town we only have a Cielo never mind my nails we only have a Cielo in Table Bay Moor and then we have a Cielo in Somerset West so unless I'm wrong you guys can correct me or you can let me know if there's another Cielo so yeah so I thought because I'm this side let me quickly pop by Cielo and, and see what they have in terms of their couches and their beds and then I have to go back to work I'm already receiving so many emails and I'm panicking because like girl whocha I don't want to slow people down. I'm seventeen, but I told I told them that I stepped out quickly, and then we'll go back on my way back. I wanna pick up a package from Take a Lot. Um, yeah, I bought some skincare, my skin functional products from Take a Lot. I'll show you guys. We'll do an unboxing together. I just got myself some coffee because. <laughs> Broken future. All the plans you made in your heart grew just to die. And now you damaged goods, damaged you. Bulletproof, look at you. What happened? Did she hurt you? Are you okay, baby? Everyone gets hurt. That's how we learn to make love work. It's part of life, but if you need a lot of love. Baby, don't cry 
but we made it and I know why I was struggling so much it's because yesterday I ate what is that song? is that a pain? okay I hope you guys can hear it but Isolo I ate rubbish I ate I had rice for dinner Girl, you don't want to know what I ate it is on. So this morning I struggled at gym. But we made it, which we made it. Right now, I, today I have so much work. I'm working from home. But the amount of work I have, I probably should not be chatting to you guys right now. <laughs> I probably should not be chatting to you guys, but I wanted to touch base. I'll show you guys, I'll give you guys a debrief of what ended up happening in Isolo. Um, when I went to the shops and I have unboxing <laughs> I have an unboxing that I'm gonna do with you guys um, probably during my lunch break or at the end of the day right now I want to tidy up take a shower and get to work It's not my fault You've been lying saying that I took away your peace Drowning by yourself, now you wanna blame me Like you have no options I ain't take your options Now I'm not the problem Man, that's on you, yeah You've been terrorizing me yeah, I'm always wrong I knew you lost your mind when you dropped that bomb Girl, are you crazy? Yeah, you must be crazy I've been thinking lately Lately it's you You stole your peace Put it on me But baby, it's I like a ride, but take your stuff back Baby, it's you, 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 you. Baby, it's you, 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 you. What did you think? What did you, you could say whatever and I would never and everywhere girl look in the mirror man you so dirty yeah you look so dirty you were never worthy lately it's you you stole your peace put it on me but baby 
baby, it's you. Lying like a ride, but take your stuff back, baby, it's you. shading and I quickly first of all I went to Boa to take off my nails and Sana now I am the girl with with crooked nails <laughs> look at this one got cut in half guess then so I'm just gonna spend a couple of days without nails and then I'll go back but anyway we had load shading so I quickly popped by Woolies because I'm not gonna cook I'd say this is a grocery haul, but it's definitely not a grocery haul. So I got this couscous dun dun salad and then this butternut and lemon. Also, I haven't eaten the whole day today. That's why I got an extra side. And I got full chicken from Woolies. This I'll probably have tomorrow for lunch or day after. I also got some smoothie. I don't know. I was supposed to drink this now because I was starving. But I figured let me come back and have dinner. And then I also got these. And one thing about me. Why is this thing struggling to focus? Yeah, one thing about me. I love some green juice. Also, I just had to top up tried and trusted sunlight for my dishes also i discovered these while i was staying in my previous apartment absolutely love these to like wipe down your counters these microfiber towels oh love them so much guess that while I was working today, I realized that first of all, hey guys, I don't, I don't, I don't think I've shown my face in the vlog today. But anyway, we did a soak off, so my nails look a little bit, a little bit crooked. In fact, a lot crooked. Like I don't know what's going on. Look at this one; got cut in half. This one as well, and then this. Sorry, guys, this is a bit gross, but this happened during my move so i closed the car door i don't know how i did that when i think about it i don't know how it happened but i was rushing 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 close the car door while this finger was like girl i don't know how it happened but bam this happened so i don't know how it's gonna come off so i've been hiding it with nails i don't know but it was here it was here so it looks like it's going up as my nail is growing anyway i'm sorry guys i'm tired that's why my energy is a little bit low like i'm so tired i've had such a long day but i have some packages i want us to open together i was supposed to show you some of the items yesterday but then again I don't know what happened <laughs> guys i've been so excited so first of all you guys know that first of all why am i saying first of all a million times you guys know that i am not with starbucks anymore i i mean some days i am but i went from drinking starbucks every single day to now making my coffee at home one, I feel like I have control over what I put in my coffee. Two, that saves me a lot of coin. So I am not I am not with Starbucks anymore. I am with making my coffee at home. So 
yeah so my coffee station currently it looks a little bit raggedy let me show you Cha, i was about to like try and make it neater i was like let me just show you how it looks like as it is it looks horrible i have this tray i got this tray from at home i was using it in this coffee station in my last apartment but i was like now i'm like no it doesn't work it does not work and i would like to start using this tray and enjoy it because i, I really like this tray and then it has my kettle then it has my coffee pods i don't know what the memory card is doing there and that tripod adapter thing which i'm gonna look for and i'm gonna struggle to find and then my coffee so no surely not surely not and one place i know guys this apartment yeah so we are also working on this bedroom project which i'll share with you guys a little bit more but now one place that i am guaranteed to come visit every single day in my house in the morning is my coffee station so i want to make it look cute <laughs> i want my coffee station to look cute i mean brighten up my day every time when i wake up and make my coffee so yeah so that's what we're working on and i've been wanting these for so long i ordered these from amazon i'm going to show you guys now i ordered them maybe like a month ago you guys know how in south Africa, amazon takes years to deliver you have to be patient so i thought to myself let me just place this order and as soon as they arrive i'm gonna zhuzh up my coffee station i've been seeing these from a lot of people including my favorite girl Ucheki Aina. i was like ah, i need them <laughs> i need them so i don't know let's get check i know they probably got these ones chair yeah, because but anyway these this is what i got these are like coffee syrup jars sana they don't come out right this is how they look sana this was packaged so nice so there's two of them in the package there's this one and this is the lid so I'm guessing you can use it either you can use this or oh you pump oh you pump I don't know if that's what I was looking for but you pump you get like this and the syrup comes out so and then this is where you're gonna decant your coffee syrup i've seen some people use it for multiple reasons but anyway this thing keeps this is how this looks like and then in this envelope Why are these name tags so small? In this envelope, there's like, and also this lighting is horrible. What's going on, Sha? Yeah, in this envelope, there's like, hey, I don't like these. Girl, <laughs> I'm so disappointed. In this envelope, there's these um, name, well, stickers that you can use so there's this vanilla one which i'll definitely be using and hazelnut caramel so yeah so you're gonna take the sticker and put it in here i am not impressed as i like to sell point dead I won't lie, I am a little bit disappointed. I feel like this sticker, I feel like it's too small for this bottle. Okay, and do you mean like, so it's going to be like that? Girl, I don't know. 
we'll try it together together and then there's this we'll try it on the funnel yeah there's this here that you can use when you want to decant your oh but they're pretty there's this that you can use when you want to decant your coffee syrup and I was so excited about this now I'm not sure yesterday I was so excited I was like let's get this because we're gonna zhuzh up our coffee station let's get everything we need so then I went to uh, I went to a home because I saw a reel from uh, Tandy and, and Christine's uh, homepage and Sana they plugged the girls they plugged us because I saw this on their page I was like a need and Sana this is the wine rack but like it was so smart of them to use it as like a coffee station situation and i've been looking for like a coffee like something like this like a stand so i think this is cute and i absolutely love that you can use it as a wine rack or for whatever reason so i'm also going to use it as a, as a coffee station stand and then I also got I also got this I have been needing this I don't know what happened to my paper towel thing so I got this one I feel like the lighting is horrible in this kitchen but yeah it's like this gold and then it's marble here Nebo. It's like marble and then it has this gold detail. And so let me mm, let me not talk too much. Anyway, I feel like this is gonna look cute in this kitchen. I also got this. It's called a honey jar. I'm not a person who uses honey a lot, but because <laughs> Because I use uh, coffee syrups and stuff, but every now and then we do. And also, if someone comes to my house and they don't like, they don't like syrups, sugar-free syrups, even they can use honey in this cute honey jar. This I'm very happy about extremely extremely happy about this is how it looks like and then it has this and then i got these i feel like this is not going to make sense up until we set up the coffee station i got these i also saw these cool christine these are so Pretty. I'll use these. It's from this. It's from, I mean, also from at home. It's called Simply Stored. What's the size? Okay, it doesn't say the size. But I'll use this for like my tea bags. So I got three of these. I don't know if I'm gonna need. So I'm not my memory card pop on me. But anyway, I also got, I went to Nespresso, I also got, I have coffee, I have a lot of coffee, but I wanted to try this caramel cram crambouille, which I think I might actually still have. Let me see. Oh no, I don't have that one. So you see, I still have coffee there. But I got this sleeve to try 
it's caramel creme brulee. I let you guys know how it is. But the main reason why I went, I wanted to get this. I wanted to get this. I don't know if it's gonna work in this coffee station because, okay, let me show you first. Let me first show you. This is how it looks like. You use it to like put all your coffee pods. Mike. You see. So you use it to display your coffee pods like this. And it says Nespresso on the side. I don't know if it's gonna work in this coffee station, Sarah. But we'll see. This is what I was using before, which I absolutely still love. Um, this one I had I got from Checkers a while back. I think this is cute. But we'll see, we'll see. So that's what I got from Espresso. And then here <laughs> What is this? Oh, this is skincare. I got some skincare stuff from Take a lot. I got these from Take a Lot. Um, yeah, some of you guys have been asking me what am I putting in my coffee. This is what I put in my coffee every morning when you see my vlogs, and I put something in my coffee. This is it. It's a sugar-free syrup from. I got it from Take a Lot. It's this brand. You can take a screenshot. So the one I've been using is vanilla. Does this thing have carbs? Almost nothing. What do they sweeten it with? Yeah. Hmm. Okay, there's erythritol and sacrulose. I never know how to say that name. But there's also a, a, a <laughs> there's also erythritol. So this is what I use my coffee, but I figured let me also try this one. Zizi, I think Zizi has this one and she says she enjoys it. This one is caramel flavored, also sugar free. They gave me, they gave me a free hot chocolate. That is so cool. Thank you. I'm gonna decant the syrup into these bottles. But let's do that tomorrow, guys. I'm tired. <gasps> I'm tired. I wanna eat. And also, like, I wanna film, I wanna make a reel when I'm sitting at my coffee station. And I think the lighting will be better in the morning. <sighs> One last thing to unbox, and then we'll call it a night. I'm gonna have my chicken with these veggies from Woolies. Okay, so this is just skincare. It's my. I ran out of these two serums. My two absolute favorite serums from my two favorite serums from Skin Functional. There's this one, the Dark Mark Management. I love her so much, Kesan. Ever since I discovered this girl, I never went back. There's this one. And yeah, okay, some alpha eye butane. And then there's this one as well, which I also like. This is basically hyaluronic acid. And it's called hydration juice. Also from Skin Functional. And then I've been meaning to try this. Zizi put me on when she was here in Cape Town. 
I tried this from her and I was like, I need it. I need it. Guess this. Yeah, this. I'm so excited to co to set up this coffee station. But yeah, let me charge this battery and then make myself dinner and then take off these clothes, wash something and call it a night. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow when we set up the coffee station tomorrow. Let's cross fingers that the vision comes to life. <laughs> So extra, but I know I'm the same. Yeah. Love me in spite of my trauma. Give me what I need instead of the drama. Cause when it pop off, it's like, oh my, all good all day. But the night, we be going so hard on the flip side. So tell me what we Hey guys, doing. hey guys. I am in my Love Kings Duke era because. I'm working from home, period. And it is, this is her. No. <laughs> Sorry, that was a work email. It is um, 12, and for the life of me, I cannot wait. I have to set up this coffee station. Also, let's remove all this nonsense. since I last spoke to you guys and a lot has happened in that hour I had a full mental breakdown because my as I was trying to give you guys angles I don't know how it happened but my camera literally fell from the counter to the floor and mind you I have tiles so I felt that fall in my heart. Like, oh, <laughs> Like, it went all the way. And then when I picked it up, I switched it on, it didn't work. And I went to full panic mode. I took out all my. Oh my gosh. Yo! Oh. Girl, I took out all my, I took out all my, the, the camera lenses I have, I have three, well two, I took them out and I kept trying and I thought to myself, maybe it's the lens, because Sana, when I picked up the lens, it was crooked, and then I put it back and then I changed lenses because I thought it was a lens, nope, 
the camera was off and then I removed these clothes wore a dress ran out of the house to go to camera land when I was one minute from camera land I thought to myself oh, let me pick up this camera again and try the light it switched on so now I like I don't wanna and I don't wanna be too excited in case if I don't know child but let's let's finish up this coffee station setup situation um I was trying to remove these handles and then I was fighting for my life this one came off like the the this thing the screw but this one is refusing and I hate these legs these handles so much because I feel like they are such a waste of they're gonna be such a waste of space in this counter and this one also is like it's like I need a it's as if I need an Allen key to take this out and I don't have it so I tried everything that I have it's not working so I was thinking when I go to gym I'm going to gym later on today I'm going to shape class I was thinking when I'm on my way to gym maybe I could take it with me and take it to builders and try and get them to give me a try and get them to help me they dream when me let your mind explore all the things we were created for possibilities and open door that keeps us reaching out to gym this morning this cap looks wrong I feel exposed I will usually wear my cap like right here when I'm going to gym girl <laughs> not that guy singing so loud in this car next to me
guys morning morning today is a thursday that washing machine is loud let me pause it that's better morning <laughs> today is a thursday and it's a public holiday yay <laughs> it's a public holiday so i'm so happy about that i'm trying to i just woke up What's the time? We okay, cannot just woke up. I woke up a while back. I don't know. I don't know when I woke up exactly. It's 10 to 10 now. And I just made myself some coffee. We have a new coffee station. <laughs> we have a new coffee station. Um, yeah, and I'm doing laundry. Like, I feel like I have so much laundry to do. So much. So I'm doing laundry and then I also want to clean the house, like tidy up. And then what else are we doing today? It's quite gloomy. It's a bit cold outside. But I do want to go to Corey Craft. <laughs> I do want to go to Corey Craft. I feel like I'm always there. But what we are doing, I think earlier in the week we went to I did vlog that right here. Yeah. Earlier in the week, we were, went to Corey Craft looking for a headboard. Instead, I found a bed. <laughs> I found a sleigh bed, which I think is going to fit. Um, yeah, it's going to fit. So I found a sleigh bed that I absolutely love. So we might pop by Corey Craft and make that purchase let me show you so they gave me these samples to choose this one is called annabelle this one never mind my nails <laughs> this one is called um Millie cement this one is giving gray i like that it's light but it's giving gray so it's not gonna be that one this one is a little bit warmer which i appreciate but there's another fabric as well that i want to try thereby Corey craft is just that they didn't have uh they didn't have what is this they didn't have fabric they didn't have fabric in the tuli cement there's another fabric called tuli cement so I'm going to go to a different core craft and see if they have that fabric and then I'll come home. I've learned that it's better to like take the samples and take them home with you and match them against your walls, against your furniture to see which one is going to work. So yeah, that's what we're doing today. But like I said, it's a public holiday. I want to take it easy. I want to have a slow, slow morning. So we'll probably go out later, later in the day. Yeah, that's the tea. I want to say I really appreciate the fact that we are furnishing this house together. <laughs> I appreciate that so much. So I want to say thank you so much for your suggestions about the couch. Also, there's a great suggestion I got about a place that I need to go check out for mirrors, for bathroom mirrors. So thank you guys thank you thank you please please continue to like give me all the suggestions about you know furniture places that i should check out or like home wear stores that you know i can check out in cape town yeah that's the tea for now i'm gonna finish my coffee i see working moms on netflix has a new season that's out period so while i'm cleaning up you know chilling oh and also i ordered breakfast stuff from willies so we'll make breakfast together so while i'm doing all that i'll be watching working moms on netflix period mm -hmm. ching ching Living for weekends, wishing I could take a 
break from this world Running on a hamster wheel And said D, when I ordered, I thought I was ordering orange juice It turns out I am ordering this thing I wanted to have a mimosa Orange, turmeric and cayenne Do you think I can make it? I'm a mimosa with this thing Above it, it all. I just wanna be free. Finally, finally, finally. I 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 always say dream. finished at Core Craft. I didn't pay for the bed because the delivery guy wants to first see if I'm not gonna have problems getting the bed to my apartment like the previous problem I had. We're trying to make sure it doesn't happen because I didn't know this. Apparently at Core Craft, if you get your bed custom made, meaning like if you choose your own color whatever whatever and they have to make the bed for you because for this bed that I'm buying I have to wait four to five weeks for delivery and then that means they the reason why I have to wait four to five weeks is because they'll be making the bed so apparently if you get your bed made then you can't return it which I mean kind of makes sense but it also I mean damn yeah you can't return it so you have to be sure when you make your purchase and it's custom made at Crowcraft but anyway 
So I didn't pay for the bed because the guy wants to come to my apartment first and see if we're not going to have any issues and then I'll make the purchase. But we did get the coat and the bed is on sale. <sighs> yeah, so um, at least I feel better about that. So yeah, and then I popped by Woolies because I'm on my way to Kaita's place, period. <laughs> I always feel so good when I'm going to see her. So I'm on my way to see my baby and I pop by Woolies quickly. I wanna do I wanna do a car haul before I drive there. I popped by Woolies and I forgot my camera in the car because I quickly went in and out. Anyway, so for a girl's night in, she's cooking, she's making uh she said she's making creamy pasta. So I figured let me get some white wine I got this uh, Sauvignon something I got this bottle uh, yeah I got this bottle of Sauvignon and then I also got Chenin I got Ken Forrester Chenin and then I've got some prawn cocktail. That these are our favorite chips. Every time when I'm with the client, not every time. If we eat chips and I'm with her, these are the chips we'll eat. And yeah, so I got that as well. And then our favorite dessert is this blueberry swirl cheesecake. Guys, never mind my nails, okay? I'm gonna get them done tomorrow. But these are the, this is the dessert that I got. This, I discovered this dessert through quite And Sana, 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. The only time I eat it is when I'm with her. Even these chips, well, sometimes I get the chips. But anyway, yeah, so that's, that's what I'm bringing to girls night in. And then I also took my laptop so that I can start editing. I also got these beef. Uh, why are you focusing on me? I also got these beef and chutney fricadales. And it's a long weekend period. So. <laughs> Let me go. I mean, I already opened these. I had one. I'm going to have another one now. Because I'm starving. Mm -mm -mm. Time's been moving slowly, so we are ready in to be. Can't get no sleep. Teasing all day and when the sun sets you asking me to come through Kicking with you, night turn to morning dew Then you feel it freshening, lose control You don't wanna go slow, for sure We both already know your place is my place Vlog, and I also thought let me come and show you guys my nails, honey, because 
I am no longer a crusty little girl. I have new nail set. I love these nails so much. I found a new nail tech. Um, they are in Salt River. It's called Lotus Beauty and something. I can't remember. I'll put their Instagram page. Um, yeah. So they are in Salt River here in Cape Town. Absolutely, absolutely love this set. And they were so nice. Um, yeah. So that's the tea. In terms of the home project, um, let's take it one, one step at a time. <laughs> we take it one step at a time, one project at a time. I'm so happy I found a, be a bed that I really, really like. Now the mission is to make sure that one, we're able to dismantle the bed. Two, the bed will actually get into my apartment because what we're not going to do is buy a bed and then get stuck with it because it doesn't fit. So, yeah, but we'll definitely get that bed, I think. Yeah, we'll definitely get the bed, but it's going to take a while. So the room project is going to take longer than I had anticipated, but I do think I should start buying lamps wall art that type of thing so that you know everything can eventually come together this lounge is the one thing that's stressing me and i think it's because i still don't have a couch and maybe i should consider getting a, a tv stand so long because i also don't have a tv stand that's another thing that i just parked because one thing about furniture, these big furniture pieces, they are so expensive. <laughs> they are so expensive, so... So, yeah, you have to just be patient. And that's something that I keep reminding myself. I have to be patient. But anyway, I'm rambling. Thank you so much, guys, for all the suggestions. That you guys are sending me on dms like the shops that i should go check out please keep them coming i feel like i should you know spend more time um visiting um furniture shops that are not mainstream i don't know if that's the correct thing to say because i feel like when i want furniture i always go to koi craft or at home or cielo you know, I always go to the big shops. So if you know of like, you know, cute little furniture shops around Cape Town, that won't, <laughs> cute furniture shops around Cape Town that are not gonna break my bank, please let me know. But anyway, I'll catch you guys in the next vloggy vlog. I'm not sure if we'll have a vlog next week, but if we do, we do, if we don't, forgive me in, av in, in advance <laughs> i'm taking a little bit of time to like you know take a break so but i don't know i don't know yeah i don't know anyway thank you so much for watching please don't forget to comment like and subscribe share the content with your friends and i'll catch you guys in the next vlog vlog <laughs> bye